So welcome to a new week's vlog. I hope you liked the last week's vlog. I'm just um, sitting here waiting for Fred to come out of Tesco. So I've just had my appointment um, with the consultant uh, regarding my heart and um, after I had the, the bilateral PE last year they found some they found some weaknesses on my heart um, and there was evidence that there could be some pulmonary hypertension which is a serious disease um, which was a con consequence of what's happened. Luckily, I found out that my heart has repaired because they can see no signs of damage on my heart. Hi everybody, welcome to the channel. Today we've got uh, an exciting vlog, haven't we? What's yes. going to be happening? Got a new kitten. We're getting a new kitten. And we've got all these things for the kitten. So we're just going to give you a quick rundown and then we'll show you how the day pans out because we're supposed to pick Pick it up, was it? About four, four, four o'clock. Okay, so what do we buy first? Travelling um, cage. Travelling cage for the cat to travel in. Quite the big one so it grows into it. How much was that? 14 quid. 14 quid. I think they're the cheapest ones. That was from Wilco's. And then we bought this uh, cat bed, a little like igloo. And that was £12 from Aldi. It's like this nice like teal sort of like velvet and it looks really comfy in there. It's got a little cushion in there that matches as well. Uh, it's called a luxury cat bed. So that is very cute. Do you like it? Yeah. We also have a scratching um, post coming but it's arriving tomorrow. You bought this. So this is go in the travelling cage. Where was that from? Aldi. Aldi. How much? I think it was six quid. Six quid. Well, that's good because it's like waterproof. Yeah. Oh. It's something to keep it warm or something. I um. Oh. There's like a silver thing in there. A heat pad. A heat pad. Let's see what it says. Soft and cozy sheepskin style cover. Insulated core with outstanding thermal performance. Perfect for keeping your pet warm in the winter. Add to any pet or simply on the floor. Add to any bed, not pet. Um, so it doesn't really need that now, but that'll be okay in the winter, I guess. But that's just to keep it comfy in the, well, yeah, well, we in the bring container. It home. And we've just got this kitten food, I'm not sure what it eats. I think the owners might tell us what it yeah. eats. We've just got that just in case, that's dry food. And then we've got kitten food. Oh, it makes me feel sick, this. <laughs> For 2 to 12 months, it's the poultry selection in jelly. It's got chicken, duck, poultry and turkey. Isn't poultry just those things anyway? Poultry, yeah, it's chicken. Should have bought the fish one. That's all they had of it. Um, what else did we buy? We've got the litter stuff. Was this a fiver? Four pound? That was five pounds for this. No, this was four pound. Was it? Oh. Yeah, this was four pound. Um, it was from this new pet store called Jolly's. 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 Um, so we've got that. And this is the cheap one. Yeah, four pounds for that big size. It's quite a good big size. The wood pellets as well. And then we got two. I don't know what the difference is. I don't know. Or oh, eco friendly. Yeah, eco. Um, two litter trays. We've got a blue and a pink. It is a girl. This kitten. Um, we think anyway. That's what the lady said. So we've got a blue one just because it goes with the bathroom and the pink one can go down here. Yeah. That was your idea. I didn't realise we had to have two didn't have to have two We haven't got a toilet down, so... <laughs> what else did we buy? You can explain all these. Cat toys. Mouse on a string. On a stick. That's like a... Mouse. Like, it's like a snake thing, I guess. Or like a, a snake. Something like that, yeah. What's that there? Something. That's where it holds on to and you Sweet swing teaser. it. And you got mouses. Mouses. Oh, we got a scoop. A scoop for the litter tray, is that? And then we bought this cheap, uh, how much was this? 150 at Poundland. Yeah, Poundland. Yeah. Is that annoying? Drilling outside. Oh. Um, took in Poundland. Was this from Poundland? Yeah. Just got two things, just for now while it's little. Um, and then, but when we saw this Garfield one in B&M's and that was £1.49 and I just thought it was cute, it says I'm hungry therefore I am and it's Garfield on there 
and it's got Garfield all around. It's really cute. The mat. And then the mat is like the last thing. Yeah. Well, yeah. the other thing you've got to wait to come. Yeah. Um, multi-purpose cat mat. I think this is too small to go under the litter tray, isn't no, it? No, no, it's for um the food. That's what yeah, we're but it says it can be for oh. litter tray. Multi purpose. Yeah, you can put that there. Okay. For the food. You can't see it then. For the food. Yeah. <laughs> um and yeah, it's got fish on it in the paw for it's for cats. That's like a weird rubber material, so I guess they can wipe it. Um, we've put all the bunting out, haven't we, yes. for the 4th of, it's 4th of July today. And then we're going to go and pick up the kitten and we're going to have a barbecue, hopefully. Yes. If it doesn't rain. And we bought some little cakes from Aldi. American cakes. American cakes. And I had my appointment with the, um, with the hospital, with the consultant today. And he said my heart is all fixed. Um, and there's no signs of weakness that the, what they can see from the scan, so that's all good news. So we're going to celebrate with our new kitten, hopefully. Yep. And all American food. And all the American food. So we've just been to pick up our new kitten. We've just been to pick our new kitten up. So we've just been to the, the mum's house and picked her up. And she's in this little... Does she look cute? Yeah. Hello, Minnie. See, don't move it about too much because she's frightened, isn't she? You can come out. She's like, I don't know this area. She's like, the rat doesn't want to cut. She's coming. Look, out she comes. Bring the food like over here, maybe for now. Oh, she's getting up. She's getting her. Oh. <laughs> oh. What's he doing? He brings your food up. He's going to go into the toilet. Oh, just look here in there. Do we need to clean that boy yet? Good girl. Good girl. Yeah, they are quite small, aren't they? Oh, what's that? Should we put more of the stuff in? breakfast so she's having this whiskers pouch stuff and um, they put a half of the pouch four times a day and then some cat biscuits but she, I don't think she's been eating those so I've not put them out today I just put the water in the other bit I watched a cat video where the man said not to use plastic things so we're going to replace that eventually it's just took it into breakfast it's very early Where's your ball gone? That little green ball they gave us that um, from her house, so it had the scent and something from home, and she does like it there. 
Just seems like it. Yeah, she closed out with more. And we got her that teddy. We playing in. I just got up so I'm not actually going to film myself but I'm sitting here and this is the first time that Minnie has actually sat on the sofa with me and she walked over here and now she's gone back over there so she's getting used to us really slowly so we're now on what day are we on now we are what, Thursday today, so we got her on Monday, Monday night. We don't count Monday, so Tuesday and Wednesday, she didn't want to sit with us. Um, and Thursday morning, she is. Yeah, you've done well, we get, you got a treat. She's having a little get together with like me mum, some of my mum's friends and my friends and she got off coming to mine and then we might come in and tell we're not really sure but we're just going to see where the night takes us. So yeah, that's the plan. We are off and it's my bed. You managed to pull them off there. Have you managed to pull them off there? Hey, they're supposed to be there. So we're here, me and Minnie, just chilling out. And yeah, we're having a lovely afternoon. We've been playing, like we said. Um, I think it's really probably going to do me good at this stage of my recovery um, to have something um, or somebody to keep me company all day and look after. Um, I have been very busy today. I would say day one of her being here, she just hid the whole of the time. She just hid behind the sofa and never came out to be honest day two which i would have said was yesterday um she was a little you were a little bit better weren't you Minnie, that day um she did come out and she meowed at us and she ran, ran up to us and let us stroke her she just didn't like us picking her up or wanted to sit with us or anything like that so you, she got a bit better and we were playing and she was playing a lot more relaxed today of course you know she's lovely sitting together we've been playing um yeah we've been having a lovely time haven't we we've been having a lovely time so yeah i think it's going to do me good i've never really i've never had a cat before uh, my sisters had plenty of cats we did have a cat briefly well my grandma had a cat briefly when we were young she was a black cat like you she was called sam but for some reason or other, she had to be rehomed. Um, I can't really remember the reasons why I was quite little. Um, but I was really upset about it. I'm sure this is the postman coming. Can you hear that purring? So today's the first time that she's done that purring. Happy? Can you hear that purring? So today's the first time that she's done that purring. Are you happy?
Um, we're still, we've been sat here and playing and sat here for the most of the day, just waiting for Fred to come home from work um, to see if she accepts him. Um, I'm saying she because I now actually think the kitten could be a boy and my sister thinks it's a boy we've inspected down below. And it does not that I'm an expert. Um, and she's actually unsure of what, what sex kit and hers is as well. Um, we're just not sure now. So Minnie might have to be Mickey. Or a totally different name. Because there's quite a lot of quite good boys' names, actually. For black cats. I don't know. Comment down below. What do you think? What do you think? If it's a boy, what should we call it? If it's a girl, what should we call her? If it's a girl, if she is a girl, I'm actually going to stick with Minnie. So actually, it's just if she's a boy, she'll have to be renamed. I don't know if I like Mickey. That was the obvious choice, but um, I mean, yeah, Mickey. Um, I like Salem. I like what else do I like? I actually quite like Spooky. Spooky cat. So it doesn't really matter, I suppose. I suppose we'll have to take um, her or him to the vet to see. I'll ask Fred to have a look later on. So day four, we're having a new sofa delivered today from Argos because uh, Fred thinks that this um, leather one. Excuse me, leather blinds. Uh, Fred thinks that this leather one is too much of a temptation for her to scratch, and she is scratching it. So he's going to sell this one, and we bought like just a plain um, corner sofa to go over there. We cleared the corner there. Uh, I don't know what that mark is on the wall. That's just appeared. I think it was where the cat scratched the wall and I tried to rub it off. Oh, well. Um, yeah, so uh, we're still in debate about whether Kitty is a boy or a girl. So I don't know if you can see. Oh. She doesn't like that. You closing them for me? Close the blinds. Will I come and see a new ball? You come and see a new bowl? Excuse me. Don't play with that. Right, so that'll get you. This is your new Halloween bowl. What do you think of it? Hey? Do you like it? Like a new bowl? Is that a yes? Should we put the whiskers in? You ready for your breakfast? So it's a perfect size. We are hungry this morning. Hungry. Smells delicious. Not. You like a new bowl? I like it. It's got little cats on like you. And it's a proper dish, not plastic.
I actually like this little bowl um, better than the one he had. Uh, or she. I think it's a boy. I think Mickey's now. Minnie is now Mickey. And there's a boy. But I don't really know. I can't really tell. Comment down below if you're good at telling. <gasps> oh, that was a good idea. Is that turning the bowl around? I thought you were going to tip it up. Yeah, I was saying I like this bowl because it's, a, it's small and shallow. So I feel like you can get to it better. Um, um, I don't think that's a good idea. You want more? There's more in your bowl. You should have seen the way we'd wrapped it. It was terrible. What, where have you got all those bits of cardboard from? Whatever it is. The packaging of the sofa. Yeah, we had to package it back up. Oh my God, it was such a hoo-ha. Um, and it looked a sight. But when the man came, it was the same man that delivered. And he was really happy and said, Wow, you fair play. You've done a really good job of packing that up. So... It was hilarious, so he's just going to continue to scratch the sofa while we decide what to do. I don't like these. This is Fred's sofa. Sorry. Oops. Um, you know, they're like those types, and they recline like the two ends, which is all fun and games, but they're not that comfortable. I just don't like leather sofas, really. I think they look, they're a bit manly, aren't they? So I wanted a nice corner sofa but the one that came with absolutely hideous i'll show you a picture of it um it was in the sale and it was reduced now a lot of people you might have you might find the taste that we have of all this weird furniture that we bought i'm looking at you court cabinet um you might find that weird but i don't like crushed velvet and it turned out this sofa was black crushed velvet which is a little bit better than the silver crushed velvet but it's just not my taste at all. I don't like it at all. And it, was, it wasn't just that, because Fred said, well, if he scratches it, it won't matter as much. But it wasn't just that. It was the fact that it was really uncomfortable and the cushions didn't fit. So the cushions that you sit on, they just sort of didn't fit to the sofa and they just looked really weird. Um, and then the little cushions that you get along the back of the those corner-style sofas with the big cushions were um tiny and it was really uncomfortable you were like suspended in midair it was horrible fred was really i wished i'd vlog, vlogged that part but it was a bit of a sensitive time and you're not allowed in the kitchen that's why you got told off isn't it i know i'm coming out in a minute i'm coming out in a minute So I've got this Whiskers cat milk. Um, I'm just going to give him a tiny bit, a little treat to see if he likes it or not. Are you liking it? Have you find it? Oh, is that nice? Is that nice? What one we gave you? Mm. I think they can only have that like one bottle once a week so you split it into four but i've not quite given in water just in case i mean you can't get it in a towel how's it got in here i don't know well, why didn't you put the net in across oh god i'm just flying about i know i know i'm Where trying to get it? it come here i'm not gonna hurt you what if it poos It's a big bird. What's it do? <laughs> what the hell? How are we gonna get it out of there? I need a bigger towel. Or oh my god, it's on my exercise bike. Why are you in our kitchen? He's coming out. <laughs> so that was the drama of having the bird in the kitchen. I just thought I'd add that in. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you enjoyed meeting Mickey, who was Minnie and is now Mickey. And that's all cleared up. We've had the the okay that that's definitely the case. Take care. Thanks for watching. Bye.